from Team Cruz, BJJ. Clayton against Victor Hugo here in the finals. Clayton has been performing very well, performed really well today. Uh, already shown to be a real fighter, a heart of a lion. Victor Hugo walks in first. Clayton, Rafael, Flores, Team Cruz, BJJ, Victor Hugo, Costa Marquez from Six Blades. Victor pulling close guard once again. Saw him do that earlier today. Looking for a little arm trap right away. Seems like he's moving to the side. Hunting for something there. One minute down in this match, 0-0. Victor Hugo on the bottom of Clayton Rafael Flores. See that Sao Paulo passing He's set trying. up again. Oh, a little bit of a disengagement. Victor Hugo grabbing that collar. We saw Clayton in a war with Bobo earlier on. The big what man. A fight that yeah. Was. Local hero. Crowd cheering. Ooh, vai passa. I mean, saying, ooh, pass the guard. Or, ooh, he's going to pass. Victor Hugo has got that belt grip. Nice, uh, quickly gets to his feet. Try to fake guard pull right there and get an ankle pick. And then ended up pulling guard. Three minutes down, seven to go. Gonna come up with a single leg right now. Oh! That was beautiful, beautiful counter. counter. Beautiful counter right there. Victor Hugo goes straight away to a back attack. But Victor Hugo uses the opportunity to get to the back of Clayton. One who can. Gets, gets both hooks in. Victor Hugo up by four points now. He's got the back. And sometimes those monster throws like that actually suck the wind out of you. Uh -huh. And I think Clayton, although he landed on Victor Hugo, I think, you know, mentally he could have broken him a little bit. Very possible. He's in deep waters right there. Now, I don't know. We, we can quite see uh, what kind of grips Victor Hugo has, but he has a lot of time to work those. Whatever he has, he has a whole lot of time, almost six minutes to work on his positioning right there.
Yeah, it was six minutes, five minutes and a half left. More than enough time, especially when you're up by four. Got both hooks in. Life is good. Life is good right now for Victor Hugo. Can't really see the, you know, the details on the call or just from our angle, but uh, Victor continuing to maintain good position. Seems like he's transitioning for something. He's gonna try something different now. Let go of the back control. Salo Ribeiro in the stands here, coaching Victor Hugo from the sides. Salo, a Brasileiro champion in his own right back in the day. One of the greatest to have ever done it. So Victor Hugo's got his arm underneath Clayton's left arm, which could indicate a katakatami if he gets Clayton's back to the mat. Clayton just signs that, no, no. this is not happening. But he's taking the opportunity to get to the mount and rack up another four points. With double underhooks, this is a bad position to be in. It was a really good armbar from this position that Bouchesha popularized. So with the, the double mount. Arm, yeah. Well, basically, you take your hands and you clasp the top of the head and make like a hook. And then you do it on both sides. And then eventually progress to the S mount. It traps the arms in place and makes it nearly impossible for them to escape and counter the armbar. I believe we actually have that uh, instructional on flu grappling with a side-by-side -side view of uh, Bouchesha hitting it in competition. And now Victor Hugo looking for Americana from the mound. We don't see that very often. Clayton forcing Victor Hugo to half guard there. I didn't see why the referee was giving a penalty. What was that for? I didn't get why either. Yeah, it looks like he gave it to Clayton. It may have been, uh, well, regardless, yeah. Victor Hugo Three and passes four. again. Swept up another five points, 15-0. Three for the pass, four for the mount. Two minutes, 25 seconds left in this match. Victor Hugo utilizing that big man flow. And just continually flowing and getting back to position. And it really shows, his experience really shows. He's able to stay calm, get yeah. the points, go back, reset again, start a whole new set of attacks. There's several minutes of pressure. Progressing, scoring. All right, two minutes, 15 seconds left in this match. Victor Hugo up by 15 points, 15 to zero, 15 zip, however you want to call it. Victor Hugo dominating this match against Clayton. Rafael Flores from Team Cruz BJJ. Nice little... Victor Hugo is just showing to be on yeah. another level right here. 
Beautiful pass attempt to the back once again. Is Victor Hugo. Taking the back, rolling. Looks like a twister right there. Gets the tap. 19-0 and submits his opponent. Crowd goes nuts here applauding him. Six Blades crew right outside celebrating. Victor's happy, he put on a clinic. Yeah, absolutely dominant performance by Victor Hugo. Up 15, Look nothing. Gets the submission and is your 2023 ultra heavyweight Brazilian national champion. Congratulations, Victor Hugo. What a performance, flawless performance right here. All right, we'll be back with more action from the 2023 Brazilian national championships. Don't go anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. We'll be right back.